Welcome to our lecture online, and now let's look at the last form in which the equation can be put, the general form, ax plus by equals c, and the specific equation we're going to deal with is 4x minus 2y equals 6. How do we graph that? Well, if we're given the equation in the general form, it's relatively easy to find the x and y intercept. To find the x intercept, we set y equal to 0. And if we do that, we get 4x is equal to 6, or x is equal to 6 over 4, which is equal to 3 over 2. So there's the x-intercept, and to find the y-intercept, we set x equal to 0. And if we do that, we get minus 2y equals 6, or y equals negative 3. So there we have the x-intercept and the y-intercept. So now let's try to graph this. Here's the y-axis, here's the x-axis, a little faint. Let's try this again. All right. Four. All right. The x-intercept, x equals 3 halves, that's halfway between 1 and 2. And y equals negative 3, that's right here. And so now they have the x and the y-intercept, all you have to do is connect those two points, and you have the line represented by that equation. And notice... Once we have the, what we call the general form, it's easy to find the x and y intercepts. Once we have the x and y intercepts, it is easy to graph the line, and that is how it's done.